Hi guys, I'm Arpit. Today we'll learn how to integrate Bright Data with Sessionbox for proxies. Sessionbox lets you create multiple browser profiles in a single window. It enables you to log in into multiple accounts on the same site at the same time. This can be very useful for scraping and social media automation. You must however secure your identity and overcome various sort of restrictions and anti-scraping measures deployed by your target website. This is where Bright Data comes in. With its various proxy solutions, you can successfully complete your scraping and automation tasks without raising any suspicion. Bright Data proxies integrate with Sessionbox so you can perform your job seamlessly. Let me take you to my computer screen and show you how. Head over to Bright Data, log in into your account and go to the dashboard. Click on proxies and create a zone. You can choose between data center, residential and mobile IPs. To automate any social platform like LinkedIn, you will need exclusive residential IPs. Configure and create the zone according to your project requirements. Click on the settings icon next to the zone name. From here you can get the access parameters like username and password. We'll use this information with session box later for the integration. For data center zones, you'll see this option download IPs list. You can copy the IPs from here and use them later with session box. Let me show you how. Install the session box Google Chrome extension. The link is in the description. Log in into your session box account. From the top left menu, click settings. Switch over to the proxy tab. You'll see these options add proxy or add multiple proxies. With the add proxy option, you can connect session box to a proxy port with your preferred settings. Put your bright data proxy credentials here. Let's name the proxy as bright data proxy. Type will be HTTP. Address will be zproxy.lum-superproxy.io if you want to use the super proxy. In case you want to use the bright data proxy manager, then the address will be 127.0.0.1. Port will be 2225. Username and password can be taken from your bright data zone settings. Copy and paste it. Let's save it. Under multiple proxies, simply put the IP addresses provided by Bright Data. Let's now test the configuration. Let's open up LinkedIn.com on another tab. Now click on the session box Chrome extension. Click on add new stored session. Let's name the session as LinkedIn test and let's assign the session Bright Data proxies. So click on the three dot buttons next to the session name and select settings. Then move to the other tab. Under proxy, you will see none by default. Change that to bright data proxies. Login into your LinkedIn account. Your session with bright data proxy has started. To confirm, we can check the event logs from the bright data dashboard. Like I can see the timestamp and the URL as LinkedIn with other details so the integration seems to be working fine that'll be all for this video i hope you learned something new today if you did make sure you hit that like button subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on my future content thank you so much for watching see you in the next one